Hey guys, it's Neil from Toronto Condos. Earlier today, I was talking about a article in the media that came out um, by CTV News that was talking about the Waterloo region. Um, and um, with, with the report that came out, uh, the Real Estate Investment Network, also known as RAIN, had put out a report saying that the Waterloo region was the number two area in Ontario to invest in. So obviously this got a lot of people's attention um, because people want to invest in the real estate market where, where things are happening, where there's growth. So I've been talking uh, about this project um, for the past uh, couple weeks called Sage X. Sage X is a pre-construction project located in Waterloo that's walking distance to um, Wilfrid Laurier University and the University of Waterloo. It's a student residence, um, student basically like a new condo residence designed. But the cool thing about it is the developer has geared it towards students that are looking for one bedroom accommodations. So the majority of the building um, contains one bedroom units. And um, it's very popular in the Waterloo market. And what I wanted to do is go through some of the details of this project. So what's really great is this developer, as you can see over here with my little mouse, I'm, I'm scrolling over it, is they're offering a two-year rental guarantee. So in addition to the two-year rental guarantee, they're also offering two years of free property management. And in addition to that, the suites are coming fully furnished. So this truly is a turnkey investment. And what I'm finding is people that are interested in this are people that are um, experienced investors. They may own uh, a couple of properties as well or several properties. And they're looking for something that they can put their money into with you know, not a lot of work that they would have to do um, for the investment. So that's, that's kind of one um, group of people that I'm finding that are interested in this. Another group of people that are interested in this are the newer investors um, that, are, that are new to this. Maybe this is their first investment. They're a little bit tentative. They may be a little bit afraid um, about property management or just investing in general. And the two-year rental guarantee, as well as the two-year property management, um, really kind of resonates with them. Um, they feel comfortable. They feel um, not overwhelmed by the idea of investing. So those are the two groups that I'm seeing that are um, attracted towards this uh, development, Sage X in Waterloo. So what I wanted to do is go through some of the available units as well as um, the rental guarantee. Um, so here we go. So this is what the developer calls a hot list. And the hot list contains um, some of the available units that they have available for purchase. So these units here that you see are available for purchase. So the smallest unit here is 320 square feet and it's 225,990. And that gives you a rental guarantee of $1,010 per month that the developer is going to offer for two years. Um, we're going to go through a few other units as well. But what I wanted to go through is the um, deposit structure. I'm just going to zoom that in. Actually, before we go through the deposit structure, let's take a look at another unit. So we, we took a look at, look at a studio unit. Now let's take a look at like a classic one bedroom unit. So a one bedroom unit obviously goes up in size. It's 449 square feet as you can see here. Purchase price is 289,990 and that gives you a rental guarantee of $1330. So let's let's compare the two. Let's compare the studio at 320 square feet over here and let's compare the one bedroom at 449 square feet. So as we scroll down, we're going to take a look over here at the uh, deposit structure, the maintenance, and then parking. So the deposit structure is a total of 60000 that the developer is requesting. And over here, it's $5,000 on signing. So the way pre-construction works is um, when you sign with the developer, they take a check for $5,000 that's not cashed until 10 days from your signing. And the reason for that is... As per law in Ontario, you have a 10-day cool-off period where you can change your mind. So within those 10 days, if you decide, you know what, this is not for me, um, I'm going to invest somewhere else, uh, the developer returns your check and you exit from the purchase and sale agreement. So crucially important when you're looking at pre-construction um, purchases, you have the 10 days um, by law in Ontario. And what's really recommended is that during those 10 days, 
you have a qualified uh, real estate lawyer that's experienced in pre-construction to review the purchase and sale agreement to, um, you know, to make you aware of what's in the actual agreement. So, so, so that's the 5,000 on signing. Then from there, there's 10,030 days that's payable. 15,000 is payable on May 1st, 2018. Another 15,000 on November 1st, 2018. And then the final 15,000 is payable on May 1st, 2019. So a total of 60,000. In terms of maintenance over here in the center, the maintenance is 26 cents per square foot. So a, a huge difference from what we see in the greater Toronto area. Um, and what's included in the maintenance is water, gas, internet, common area upkeep, building insurance, reserve fund, uh, landscaping and garbage removal. So since these are student um, geared properties and residences and one bedrooms, you know, to have internet available there is, is, is a huge plus for the students. So, and 26 cents per square foot is much, much, much lower than the, than the average within the greater Toronto area. Parking, if you want parking, is $39,000 per spot. You don't have to have parking, but the developer offers that um, if you do want it. And they do note that if you do have parking, their lease, their guaranteed lease will increase by approximately $100 per month. So if, if, if you want, you can have parking, but you don't have to have parking. And if you take parking, you'll have a $100 increase on your guaranteed rent for the two years. So now let's take a look at a couple of floor plans. So let's first take a look at the floor plan for this 320 square foot unit priced at $225,990 with a rental guarantee of $1,010. Okay, so I'm gonna scroll down here all the way to, yes, so here's the unit we're talking about, 320 square feet. So on the right hand side here, it shows you where exactly the unit is located. So on the second floor, it's kind of in the lower right hand corner of the building, third floor as well, and fourth floor and fifth floor. So in the same section uh, on each floor and sixth floor as well. So if we scroll back up, we're gonna take a, a walk through basically of the unit. So as you walk in here, this is the foyer. Um, you come in here, this is your, um, basically your coat closet. Come a little bit further, this is your full bathroom over here come in a few more steps and you're into your, your galley kitchen. So you've got your sink, your fridge, your stove here, right into your eat, your eat-in area over here, maybe some small shelving over here, and right into your sleeping area. So you've got your bed set up here, uh, it looks like a TV, uh, a night table, and then your closet. Uh, and then you've got your windows here. So this, this unit does not have a balcony. Um, so yeah, compact space. It's for a student who does not want to live in a noisier um, student house on off of campus, and it's really geared towards um, you know um, students that are more serious, like you know that want to work, that are um, devoted to you know getting uh, high marks and that sort of thing. And and it's important to note that the developer uh, of Sage X, so Innate Developments, is. Um, filling a gap within the Waterloo market where there is a shortage of one bedroom units um, and they're really producing a product that, um, uh, th that there's a lot of demand for. So, so that's basically a walkthrough of a, um, of a studio unit. So let's go back up to the top here and let's take a look through a one bedroom unit. So 449 square feet. This one is listed at 289,990. And the, the rental guarantee is $1,330. Okay, so let's scroll all the way down. Okay. Here we go. Okay, so 449 square feet. So on the right-hand side again here, um, it shows you where the unit is situated in the building. On the second floor, third and fourth floor, fifth floor and sixth floor, kind of the midpoint of the building. Um, and let's take a walk through the unit. So you come in here, here's the foyer. Over here, you've got your, um, your coat closet. This looks to be either, um, it's either laundry or some sort of storage. Over here, we've got um, the kitchen once again, so the sink, the fridge, the stove. We've got the bathroom over here. And as you come in further into the unit, you've got your eat-in area over here, your eat-in kitchen. 
This is more of a classic one bedroom because you've got the bedroom that's closed off here. Here's the bed, night table, and then this is your closet. As you come further in, there's a little area here where um, you can have a desk, so a little study area uh, for, for reading or to work on your laptop. When you come further in, here's the couch, uh, coffee table, and then TV as well. So a little bit more spacious unit at 449 square feet. Um, obviously, as you go higher in price, um, you're going to have a higher rental guarantee, and the square footage is going to increase as well too. So once again, these are the available units that are for sale in Sage X. Um, if you have any questions, or in fact, if you want um, this, so if you want uh, floor plans and pricing, let me know, send me a message, and I can send this out to you. Um, and uh, what else do I want to cover here? So uh, let me know. I'll send this out to you, floor plans and pricing. Um, that's about it. So, so just to cover the project once again, so Sage X is um, it's walking distance to uh, both universities. Um, and again, the rental guarantee is two year. It's a two year rental guarantee. Um, it's two years of free property management. And as well, the units come fully furnished as well. So that's about it. Um, the Waterloo market, um, you know, it's, it's definitely a market that is poised to kind of explode. And there's a lot of development occurring in this market as we see with developers like this. So yeah, like I said, if you have any questions, let me know, send me a message. Or if you want floor plans and prices, uh, send me a message as well and I'll get this to you. Okay, hope you have a great day and uh, bye for now.